I try to proactively help. <laughs> I'm actually getting a little sad. Hold on. I have one of the most incredible communities of people. I want to give you back your $2,400 because I couldn't help you. Are you kidding me? No. <gasps> <gasps> Really? Yes, ma'am. So I'm going to show you where scammers had a victim and were just about to get a big payday right before we stepped in. Now, there's a few ways that this all happens. One of them is we could be listening in to a scammer's call with a victim. We also could be on a scammer's computer watching a victim fill out either a refund form or logging into their personal bank account. This would give us maybe an address, their phone number or name. Another way is we may download files off a scammer's computer, which we can go through later and track down victims and reach out to them. And another way is we could be on the phone with a scammer and hear a scam in progress in the background. And this is probably the most difficult to stop, but it can happen. It's just extremely rare. I gotta figure out how I can save that person. Who you are, you tell me. What's my husband's number then, if, if you really are PayPal? Let's go! Let's freaking go! So these are just a few examples over the years of stopping scammers right before they steal people's money. Let's get into it. Here's our phone number. number. Oh, you have a number? Okay. Well, yeah. Call the crap out of that. I'm going to blow this phone up. <laughs> yeah. She, she, he said pick up the call. Pick up the call. She's going to pick it up. Carl, we might need you also if you want to freaking shoot this guy out. Hello, ma'am? Hello? Hello? Hi. Can you hear me? Yeah. Hi. Um, could you maybe hang up the other line with that scammer that you're talking with? They're trying to steal your money. Are you on, are, are they on your phone right now? Are they connected no, to your phone? phone? Yes, I'm trying to, to get something straightened out on my bill. Well, these guys are internet scammers are pretending to be YouTube. And um, that's why we wanted to call you and text you as many times as possible because they're going to try to steal money from you. They're going to connect to your phone. They're going to have access to your phone. They're going to watch you on your phone without you knowing, and they're going to try to steal your money. So I, we want to warn you because they're, they're bad dudes. It's not YouTube. I promise. Oh, Randy Kalatka, huh? What are you doing? What are you doing, buddy? Huh? This, hey, Beta, this is your father here. Main Tata Bapun, okay? You're not gonna scam. You're not gonna steal money from this person, okay? You understand me? Hey, Bol, 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 speak to me. I know you understand what I'm saying. You guys. Ma'am, I'm telling. I, I'm telling you, you should you should hang up from this from this guy. He's a scammer. I don't know who to believe. Okay, go go to YouTube and type "scammer payback" and you'll hear my voice. A guy with blue hair that doesn't like scammers. I just want to pay my bill. I'm a 69 year old woman. I just want to pay my bill. I understand. Bill. I know it's frustrating. Okay, and I'm gonna help you. I promise you. Okay, we'll get it figured out. I know it's really frustrating. This is all very odd, but these guys are scammers. You notice how quiet he is because he's a scammer. He's listening to this conversation and he knows he's been owned, okay? okay That's so why I was speaking to him in his language so he knows that we know and we're watching and we wanna protect you, I, okay? What am I supposed to be doing? If you want, you can hang up from that scammer and we'll call you back directly and we'll make sure you're safe, okay? And how do I know that you're not a scammer? I understand, I know it's scary. So if you wanna, we have um, a YouTube channel, it's called Scammer Payback. If you want to go verify, you can search for me and you'll see my face. I have some really crazy blue hair and Hi. you can hear my voice. He hung up. Oh, okay, he hung up. Okay. So it's just, I think it's just you and I right now. So how do I know that I have it? Should I put a stop payment, a stop on my debit card? Um, I think that would be safe uh, for the time being until we figure out what's going on. Okay. It, okay. I know it's scary, but we're, there's people out there trying to protect others and, and you know, some guardian angels out there. So that's why we're talking today, okay? We want to protect you. Can I tell you something? Yes, ma'am. My name is Angel. 
Aww. <laughs> Woo! Dang. Okay. That's pretty cool. That's really cool. <laughs> Somebody oh. take the phone. <laughs> oh my Man, God. that's crazy. Okay, we got like a whole group of people here. Uh, we wa we're watching these scammers and we're trying to protect people. So. I don't know what I'm supposed to do. I don't know either right now. <laughs> Jeez, okay. Oh, Here, are you yeah. talk, because I need a second. Uh, yeah, you're basically uh, Angel. Uh, my name is Art. Everything is going to be okay. We, 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 we got this guy. That's it. This guy is gone. So you, you're not in danger anymore. Thank you. Absolutely, Angel. Much love. God bless you. And um, stay safe out there. You too. God bless you too. Have a good, have a great whatever Wednesday, whatever day it is. <laughs> It's Wednesday. <laughs> <laughs> oh my gosh. Uh, no, because I have grandkids and I watch on Wednesday. Yeah, that's amazing. <laughs> yes, that's very sweet. Well, say hi to your grandkids and uh, continue with your day, okay? Thank you very much. You're welcome. Bye bye. That's <laughs> nice job. Yeah. Yeah. Come on, guys! Yeah. Nice job. And this is what it's all about. <laughs> amazing. Oh. Yeah. Yeah, we're trying to help somebody that they're currently being scammed. What's your involvement? Like, how do you know? We stop internet scammers, so we we were monitoring and saw them doing this. That's okay. why we noticed that. Were you just at her door? Yes. Okay. What? How do you know that? <laughs> is she in there? That's her. That is. What is the cost? Give her what? Sam or payback? <laughs> She's here. I can tell her everything if she wants me to explain. I can for sure explain everything. <laughs> Do you want them to explain if you want us to do something different? How do you know? Yes, ma'am. How do you have to call the phone? No. Okay, so we have uh, capabilities oh, yeah. where we're able to watch the scammers, and when we see a scam that's happening, we can actually intervene. We were just lucky that we were here, so we were going to intervene, you know, locally here to help you out. So the only reason we know your information is because. I could see some things. I could see your name. Okay. It's called scammer pay. So you work with law enforcement directly yes. sometimes. We okay. work up to like the federal government if we have to. Okay. So we're trying to go okay, after so the why criminals. Don't you get scammers. Go after the need. Whoever. Yes. If you want to give that to us, we I will have, have uh, the federal government go after them. Get the county police to go and arrest them. I, know. I am really afraid right now. I have never felt more vulnerable. I know. Yeah, I know. I'm so sorry. I'm so sorry. That we just want to help you. I'm. I'm really sorry that this has happened. He's explaining to her how you know how this kind of all went down and how we were able to notice her being scammed because she's very upset when we initially talked to her. So she seems to be calming down now, which is typical. Um, so. She just went to go offer her a coffee or something if we needed to get her something. You know, she's upset. So it's a very stressful situation, but it's also an amazing situation because she's not scammed out of her money. I see these stories on television all the time and I always say, how can somebody be that stupid? And I'm not saying this just, but I have a master's degree and I thought that I would never be that, ignorant or that stupid to be caught up like this. Yeah. But I, but I was. Yeah. I mean, I was just really. Thank you, Mama. Thank you. Hey, we're just glad you're all right, yes, man. Get frustrated on you. We have to complete this procedure. One second, okay? My son's calling it. I need to tell him I'm not. I need to kind of get him off of my tail, okay? Guys, I'm really sorry. I have a very. I'm gonna put some music on. I have a very important phone call to make. Um, I have a very, very important phone call, so I have to, I have to go on mute. This is very important. What the bank would do, it would yeah. make it look like me from us. Yeah, for sure. Well, they just, they just did a wire today, so, you know. This is a scenario that I think would preserve any sort of concern about, like, you know, we went too big and it triggered something. 
Yeah, they have a thing on here. It's, it's got a <clears throat> notepad that says, I have a family back in Taiwan and Hong Kong. They're starting business back in Hong Kong for leather, for purses and ladies' shoes. So I'm supporting my family. I'll also be moving back to Hong Kong by the end of this year. So this is a trustworthy payment. I want you to authorize it. So that would be $400,000 in the past two days. Yeah, dude, just go do it. It's fine. They already think that they're in like the clear. You know what I mean? It looks like, because this dude is going fast through her computer. So she might still be at the bank doing this. You guys can maybe do a call and do your thing. Let me know. All right. Thanks, man. All right. See you. So that was, I'm streaming right now, and that was a $148,000 wire transfer. We don't want them to know that we're watching them and stopping this shit. But at some point, I literally cannot let that go. I, I can't let somebody liquidate all their assets and send. I just can't for a YouTube video. I don't care if a YouTube video gets screwed over because of this. I would love to have a, a viral video, but it becomes a point where you're watching this and you just, you can't. It's not you know. worth it. It's not worth a freaking YouTube video at all. All right, sorry guys, um, I'm back. As you guys know, sometimes I run across things that are very disturbing while I'm monitoring certain situations. And it might be while I'm streaming because I still have to stream and monitor and do all this stuff at the same time. And there's some times where I have to step in um, and try to do something. Whatever happens with this situation that I'm investigating, they are the most sickening. Like literally scammers are the most sickening to me. I'm telling you guys, like honestly, I almost can't stream right now because I'm really rattled right now. Um, it really pisses me off, man. Dang, it's to see some of these things. It really rattles me because these guys are jerks, man. I, I told you guys earlier that these people are just numbers to them. Um, they laugh about it. These people deserve like so, they deserve so much jail time. These are the lowest forms of, j of, of criminality, even if that's a freaking word. Like it's the lowest form. Uh, my hands are like shaking right now. I'm so pissed off right now. <sighs> Go on the computer and do it because then they'll know. But well, you... I'm going to lose my mind right now. I know. I, I'm like so like, so I know. Am, you guys lose all my money now? Well, like, well we, need to, we need to stop it. You need to believe me and we need to stop this, okay? That's, we can stop it if you believe me, okay? Oh my God, I really want to keep my stuff right no, now. No, like, don't. I don't know if we need to scam I, because they, they, they were like so professional. I promise you that I'm not steering you wrong. I know this is a very, you're in information technology, okay? From one IT person to another, I'm trying to protect you, okay, from these guys. They just want to steal your money. So um, how can I believe you? You can go to my channel because on your phone, go to my channel. Or go to, so go go on your phone right now and go to Google and type in scammer payback onto Safari. You but but they, they monitor it, so if I do that, they will see it. No, that's that's a lie. So there, there's nobody monitoring your phone. They just say that so you don't go on your phone and talk to anybody. These guys are slick right. scammers. You know I, how I'm much? Gonna, I, I want to like just disappear. I want to leave this world right now. No, and, no, 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 no. I'm here to help you, okay? Back. I promise you I'm going to help you. You're okay. You're safe with me, okay? So you, can you just turn your computer off, please? They're clicking through um, all of your stuff. Is that you or is that them? No, it's them. Should okay. I have like a hard stop it? Yeah, or? hard. Just unplug the cable or something. Just turn it off, please. Okay. All right. It's gone. Okay. That's a good first step, but you need to call Capital One immediately, cancel it, and you can call me back and we can go to the next step. Okay. Okay. Let me call my bank now. All okay. right. Thank you so much. Okay. Call me back. Okay. All right. Bye. All right. Bye-bye. I, I do want to say that um, it's crazy because you can hear the victim like literally thinking I'm a scammer and the way that they do is they say that the hackers are watching and listening and when they have someone when they have someone so hoodwinked it makes it difficult for them to kind of discern like what is real and what's not and it, the saddest part about that is that like she pretty much said like I don't even want to be around anymore did you hear that? I don't know if yeah, you heard that. Yeah. She's like, 
I just wish I was even here, which is why we do this, <laughs> why we go after scammers, because they don't give a crap about the victims and like what emotional abuse that this does to somebody that they don't even want to be around anymore. I want to give a huge shout out to NordVPN for partnering with us on this scam bait. I've been using Nord whenever I call these criminals and it's super easy to use. Literally with just one click of a button, I'm connected. My internet traffic is encrypted and my IP address is hidden. It doesn't matter if I'm on my phone, my scam bait VMs, or even my smart TV. NordVPN is on every major platform to make sure that you're protected. Their servers are super fast. And you can choose from thousands of servers around the world that are so lightning quick that you won't even realize that you're using a VPN. One of the things that we've been utilizing in the office recently is functionality called MeshNet. And what that allows us to do is for files that we need to work on with others around the globe, we can actually send these files safely and securely. Head on over to nordvpn.com slash progy for an exclusive four month free trial that you're not gonna find anywhere else. It's risk free, so you can try it for 30 days. And if you don't like it, you can get your money back guaranteed. nordvpn.com slash progy. And let's get back into the call. Okay, so I'm trying to catch a live scam in process right or progress right now. All right, I got the I got the cell phone number, and then I'm gonna get his other phone number. I'm, we're gonna call him right now. Hi, this is Gina. What we're gonna do is we're gonna take over. We're gonna take. We're gonna we're gonna lock the screen so this guy can't do anything, and we're gonna write on the screen that, that she's on with internet scammers. Watch this. At the tone, please record your message. I couldn't do it. When you finished recording, you may hang up or press one for more options. Hi, ma'am. Uh, you are on the phone right now with internet scammers. Please hang up the line. They're on the, your computer using a program called AnyDesk. Call me back, please. I, I want to help you. All right, we're gonna get this. We're gonna save this person. Don't worry. So, so this is her. These are her numbers right here, and this is the name right here. Look, this is her name. Both of those are hers. Yep. All right, I'm gonna call. I'm gonna call the sheriff's department. Uh, hi, officer. There's someone in your county right now that's on the phone uh, with an internet scammer. They're connected to her computer, and she's not picking up her phone. Um, is there any chance there could be a welfare check or something? Maybe someone could go by her home. Okay. Has she given her any information yet? Yes. Given them she, any she's given them uh, both her phone number, her cell, and telephone, and her address, uh, her email ID. Her date of birth, which is 1941, her bank name, they're going to either do a Zelle transfer or they're going to see how much is in her bank and, and try to steal all of it. Uh, if she gives them banking information, Social Security, then we can we can set it up for a deputy to give them a call. Okay, thank you. I have an idea. I have an idea. I just can't show this one I'm going to do, but I have, I have a good idea. You got her? All right, we got here, her. Here, 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 here. Hi, ma'am. I don't save it, right? Shut down. Yeah, please shut down your whole computer. Oh, man. I know. I'm sorry. I'm glad we got you, though, because I didn't want them to. I was even trying to send the sheriff over to your house <laughs> to help you. Oh, you were? Yes, ma'am. <laughs> <laughs> yeah, so they were Norton Antivirus. The guy's name was Daniel, right? Yes. Yes, ma'am. So we were watching him, and we saw that he was talking to you. And... and they were going to try to take all the money out of your bank account. Oh, jeez. I know. But you're what? safe. You're safe for right now, okay? They're going to call you a bunch. No matter what they tell you, I promise you, they're lying to you, okay? Okay. Yeah, just if you can for a little bit of time, um, I'm going to keep following him around right now. I'm chasing him on the internet. <laughs> so just keep your computer <laughs> off. Brandon's going to talk with you, and we'll make sure that you're good. And we're going to follow okay. up and make sure that you don't get scammed. All right. Okay. Thank you very Yes, ma'am. Let's go. Woo. So, I don't even know what to do now, baby. I'm like shaking, dude. <laughs> dude, I told her. I told her <laughs> we were cranking up the trip. I'm like, listen, I feel like we were on a high speed chase together. I'm like, answer the phone. <laughs> oh my gosh. Uh, so, <laughs> gosh dang, y'all.
Trying to see if there's anything juicy here. There's a text now log. We might have some potential victims from phone calls that they've made. Hello. Hi, hi. C can you hear me, ma'am? Yes. Hi. Um, sorry. So I know this is a very random question, but your information was on the scammer's computer that I came across, and I wanted to proactively call you and see if you've been in contact with them at all. Yeah, I got scammed. Okay, you did? Yes. What happened? Do you mind telling me? Because I'm, I'm here to help. I'm sorry. Um, well, I got an email um, from Norton, which I'm familiar with Norton Security, and said that your account will be charged $293. Right. So I wound up getting $2,400 in gift cards to pay them back. Um, and I know. So... <laughs> I'm really sorry. Well, um, I just want to let you know. So part of, um, I try to proactively help. <laughs> I'm actually getting a little sad. Hold on. Um, I'm sorry. Yeah. I have one of the most incredible communities of people. And uh, we have a thing called the force. And it's people that mm. have put money together uh, for people who have been victims of these scams. And um, wow. I want to give you back your $2,400 because I couldn't help you. Are you kidding me? No. <gasps> <laughs> really? Yes, ma'am. If you would allow me to. I was, if you'd allow I was me crying. To. Yeah, I was crying because I was sad on Friday. And I'm yes, crying because it's just unbelievable. I can't believe it. Well, you don't deserve what they did to you, okay? I know, and I, I consider myself very smart and yes, astute. And I can't believe I got suckered. I mean, just, I was so caught up into paying them their money back, and it was all a scam. I, yes, I didn't realize it the whole process. <laughs> yes, ma'am. I have really incredible friends, really incredible friends, and um, we are, it's them, it's not me, it's them. They're going to, they're going to give you your money back. Well, we can. Can you uh, hold on for one second? Can yes, ma'am. Yes, ma'am. Can you hold on one second, please? Yes, ma'am. Well, I'll be dang, um, crying like a baby on my stream today. That's what the force is about. That's what this whole freaking channel is about, is if we can save someone to help someone. We just had someone proactively. We've had two okay, people. Okay, I'm back. Um, okay. I was just chat chatting with my daughter because she <laughs> said she was watching um, stations that um, the guy disguised himself as an old lady. To, yes. Uh, to oh, shoot. honey, yes. This is. I can do that as well. <gasps> oh, no way, that's you? <laughs> oh, yes, honey. It's for, you, it's for real? I told you it was me. Oh, my goodness. So. Oh, wow. Yes. Okay. Yes, so. You know the I'll, crazy I'll thing? All right. I know this is so silly. Okay. Mm -hmm. I'm actually going to be down that way. I could physically even hand you the check if you want, if you'd be interested. Really? In yes, ma'am. I, I, I forgot I'm actually flying uh, down that way uh, this week. Yes. Praise the Lord. Thank you. <laughs> yes, Thank you. All right. All right. God bye bless bye you. now. All right. God bless bye -bye. you. Dang onions, baby! Now it came up, it must be downward because it's meant to open it. Okay, there should be that number, that nine digit number. This is, I know, this is what the scammers do. It, it sounds crazy. This is gonna be me. I'm hitting connect, so if you see something, if you could hit like accept or. It's a scammer payback. That is us. We'd like you to <laughs> <see>. Awesome. <laughs> so. Do they have you create a Coinbase account, essentially? Yeah, yes, okay. they do. So they probably had you on the Coinbase, had you put in like your debit card or your bank information into that to do the dummy yep, transaction. Yep. Right. And then they had you delete Coinbase after you did all of that? Yeah. Okay. We need to get you back on there to see if you can get the account details and information. All right, passwords. Save passwords. Check oh, passwords. There we go, right here. We'll see if, well, since we know the password, we can just go into the actual thing now. <sighs> Let's... Please let this work. That's it, right? So we're in. That's oh, it. Yeah. Oh, there's our money. Oh, oh there's your money. Woo! Let's okay. see if we can get this thing secured, though. Yeah. So I just want to ask y'all's permission, though, if we can try to log in onto the on our computer. I want to okay. make sure you're okay with it first because it's just going to be easier for us to try it. Yep. I appreciate your help. For sure. Boom. There we go. Okay. Boom. Okay. Let's, let's see if we can transfer. Yeah. <laughs> Some of your funds may be temporarily available until we yes. wait for a big transfer. Available to send in seven days. 
I know you said that um, that you might have gotten an email, so that sounds exciting. That's a good good thing that's happening from Coinbase. Yeah. Okay, so if you can fire up that phone, please. Okay, go to Coinbase. Yes, ma'am. Alrighty. Alrighty, perfect. Okay. So we see the balance up here. Add cash slash cash out. Look at that. Woo! Oh, no, geez. USD amount, $4,753.07. Okay, perfect. All right, so I'm going to hit cash out. Okay. And then it's going to go into, let's see if this is going to work or if they're going to give us an issue. It says your cash is on its way. Oh, uh, okay. You can remove any desk I just got off of there, so... Okay, any desk is uninstalled. Yep. Yeah, All right, I'm going to call this scammer up and see if I can. <clears throat> Let's see if we can get him. The text now subscriber you are trying to reach is not available. Please leave your message after the tone. This is Pierogi with Scammer Payback. I just want to let you know I'm on the phone with Mr. Carl. You tried to steal some Ethereum from him. And I just want to let you know officially that uh, that Ethereum and Bitcoin has been sold and put back into their accounts where it rightfully should be. So I think Mr. Carl and his wife have a couple words for you as well that you can listen to. Mr. Eric, I have to tell you, I have never in my life met anybody that I dislike more. I don't know where you have the gall to steal from people that work hard for their money. And I just can't tell you, I don't hate you, but I have so much dislike and distaste for you right now. I, if I had you here right now, I literally would kick your ass up so high that you'd have to take your socks off to brush your teeth. <laughs> and I apologize, but I just, <laughs> I just don't even know what to say to the guy. I'm just so mad at him. I know. But I'm not going to put hate into it because I don't hate anybody. I understand. Well, we were lost. Yeah. We were absolutely sure. lost. You've been a blessing <clears throat> in our life, I tell you. And uh, it's hard to explain how we feel about what you guys have done. We never knew there was anybody out there that could even help you like that. Yeah. <laughs> I hope you have the merriest of Christmases. I'll tell you what, it was pretty tight until just now. Of yeah. course. Well, Merry Christmas yeah. and we'll talk here soon, okay? Well, Merry Christmas. Okie doke. Bye-bye. That's what I'm talking about, man. Scammer Payback is is about what that conversation just was. It's about being there at the nick of time, getting information, and what can you do with that information? How can you change lives? How can you help people out? Mr. Carl and his wife, that is the heart of what Scammer Payback is. I don't take that lightly. I, don't, I take it very seriously. It's an incredible feeling to be able to have those conversations, and, and I could have been their entire savings. Who knows? I don't know. But... Um, I do know that the money did not go to a terrible scammer. Thank you again for watching, and uh, don't get scammed.